Hello, welcome to um, Dead Channel Reviews, um, Dead Meme. So you guys may or may not remember the 3am challenge on YouTube. It was a dumb thing that channels like Derv and Ruby Roops. All these dumb channels that I wish didn't become as big as they did. Could be calling some cartoon character at 3am or going to McDonald's at 3am or killing themselves. And basically doing these things at 3am would make oh spooky occurrences. Oh McDonald's Happy Meal had rats in. Oh it's cause of 3am. Um it was dumb. <sighs> but the trend's not dead. It's nowhere as big as it used to be, but it's not dead. Now tell us like lie, the 3am specifically challenge it's somewhat dead. No one as big as it used to be. But that doesn't mean you can't still do it. Reskinned. No, because now the 3 p.m. challenge is a thing. Same premise, basically same videos. Do I even need to mention that these videos are fake? I think you guys have brains. And these videos get millions of views. Kill me. Now if you're wondering where the 3 a.m. trend thing came from, the whole thing about 3 a.m. being a spooky hour and all these spooky things happen at 3 a.m. in the morning goes back a really long time ago. Basically 3 a.m. is the witching hour, specifically between midnight and 3 a.m. where all these spooky things would happen. It's like a religious thing. So to have a challenge based around that logic, 3 p.m. would be the opposite. Right? Good stuff only happens at 3 p.m. 3 a.m. is the bad time. 3 a.m. the witching hour. 3 p.m. is the, the bitching hour. At 3 a.m. there's spooky ghosts. At 3 p.m. there's many bit not gonna finish that. I thought it'd be funny just to look through some of these dumb 3 p.m. videos and just just uh, th I'm gonna wanna die, I know I am. Okay, so I type in 3pm challenge, this video comes up, it was 10 months ago, but it's by Guava Juice, 9 million views. 9 million. Do not play Charlie Charlie at 3pm at 9, 9,999.99%, 9 but it's not point because it's a comma. <laughs> Let's go to recent, shall we? Okay, this is recent. Wagmong replay in 3pm challenge scary. Doesn't sound English, but okay. 437,000 views in the last week. Here we go. So, let's see you guys. Welcome back to the video. Hey, I'm going to get 3pm challenge. Okay, he's not English. Whoops. Oh, that just hurts even more. This this challenge is international now. Please don't. Oh god, she's back. Oh no. I forgot to mention Ruby Rube, if you remember, you know, after the whole Derv dying thing, she was the new big meme. She was doing dumb 3 p.m., 3 bit, 3 a.m., calling people and all this dumb stuff. Her brand has since expanded. She now has her written name channel. She has Ruby Games. She has a channel with her sister. Her sister has a channel. She gets decent views. Come on. Do not play Momo at 3 a.m. Here we I gave her an ad. Okay, so playing a horror game at 3 a.m. Uh, it changes. It changes the game. Oh my God. Hey everyone, it's Ruby Games. Well, we're gonna be playing Momo in Roblox, guys. If we don't know who Momo is, we are gonna be playing Momo in Roblox. In Roblox. <laughs> oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, wait. She gives me the creeps. Comment down below. She gives you the creeps. It's just the art. Oh, that was my uh, bedtime alarm. She has 125k. I can't, this is 3 a.m. We need to look at 3 p.m. Just have a look at Guava Juices, shall we? What's up, YouTube? So, it's been a while since I did a ghost video. I always do it at 3 a.m. So, today I'm going to try to see what happens when I do it at 3 p.m. We're gonna do the Charlie Charlie challenge. This guy's 11 million subs and he does this. <laughs> is this a, this is a parody, right? Please tell me it's a parody. Let's go up to the spoopiness. Try to break the spell is you just break the pencils. There you go. Charlie, Charlie, we are done. Thank you. All right, thank you all for watching today's video. It's really weird. Um, I told him to stop. I told that guy to stop. Like, Charlie! What is this? Was this here earlier? No. It smells like toothpaste. I don't know what to say, bro. I really can't tell if this is, he's trying to be serious or not. If, he, if he's just like, hey, this is clearly a parody. Thank you all for watching today's video. You guys have been amazing. Whoa! It's clearly nobody under that. Oh, why do they want to make this video? It just hurts. 
It just hurts. Why don't I do videos like this? He gets a lot, a lot of views. 3 p.m. Haunted Mall gone wrong. Today I'm going to go to an abandoned mall by myself. Now people have said that they saw ghosts in this mall. Hopefully I make it out alive. Let's hope. Nobody is inside. It is so creepy, so scary. Okay, this one is weird because I like the idea of like a, of exploring abandoned places. Like I really like the, like doing that. Like I would want to do something like that eventually myself and so if you just made a video going around it then that would have been cool but you've made it all 3 p.m challenge oh damn there are more pencil marks on this wall what in the world happened here there's a big old hole in the wall why does the camera turn so crap when she turns it around there are more pencil marks on this wall what in the world happened here my heart is pounding it's just so creepy there's a 1-800 number Somebody call that number and see what happens. So I just tell your audience to call a number. That's why you something to do with a business. Oh my god, y'all. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Y'all, I am seriously about to freak out. There are handprints on this window. Look at yeah. this. Y'all. Yeah. Freaking handprint. Why is there a handprint on an abandoned building? Maybe because people like you come into it. And it's clearly easy to walk into it as you're doing it right now. And nobody's told you off for it. Maybe that's why. No one is here. This music really doesn't fit what she's trying to get across. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna we're gonna walk closer, and this is adventure music from Indiana Jones. <laughs> Give us some kind of atmosphere. Come on, Kiki Pepper. The trash can says Penny something. Pennywise is Pennywise. Oh my God. Just... Oh. Hey. <laughs> That clearly wasn't edited in post, was it? Jesus Christ. So far, the 3 p.m. one just seems like a, a more tame version of the 3 a.m. challenge. You know, if you want some big spoops, you're gonna have to watch the 3 a.m. videos. But if you're, you're, you know, you don't want to be scared too much, you want to see some scary things, but you don't want to be jump scared, you don't want to be freaked out too much. 3 p.m. challenge. I mean, it makes sense, right? 3 a.m. is the witching hour, it's very late at night, and it's very dark. But 3 p.m. it's light outside, and it's if you're scared, you don't gotta go to sleep. Just walk about the house for a bit. <laughs> there you go, she did do a 3 p.m. one. Yes, thank you. Why has she got ads in every single video? Is this a gaming video? What is this? Ruby, why don't you put it on your gaming channel? Ruby Games, subscribe. You edits these. I have a feeling like her dad edits them or something. Like she can't be the one. She has a, <laughs> she has a fan mail. Ruby Rube merch. There's merch. Really? Can I see it? <laughs> New merch coming soon. Is there like a mailing list I can sign up to? Hold on. Please give your email to be the first to hear about it. Hell yeah. I think that is his, I think that's his email, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Basically, it's this creepy little granny that comes and finds you. You gotta try and escape out because you don't want to be a granny because it smells like an old people's home. Oh, that's the worst. But yeah, guys, I'm actually. She's like a mini Amy Schumer. There's a pretty mean thing to say. <coughs> All right, where's the call bit? That's what I want. I don't care about the video game. Oh my gosh, look at the photo. It's so creepy. <laughs> and the emoji, the granny. I didn't see the photo. Oh my gosh, and she has an email. Granny Granny is at time 3 p.m. at Granny's Basement 3 p.m.com. <gasps> oh my gosh, girl. Do you think we should call or FaceTime? Hmm. I think. I'm gonna guess by the title. I actually want to see her because she could have just killed me then in the game. But I want to see her face. I want to see if she actually talks to us. So That's a good reason. There's gonna be people telling, saying I'm bullying her here. I'm not. Alright, I, I feel like she has, a, she has a channel with over 2.1 million subscribers, and yes, she's young, but I feel like if you have a channel like that, your content is allowed to be criticised. Like, I don't think we should all pretend that her content's fantastic because she's young. Like, I'm not judging her as a person. I don't... I don't... She's probably fine. I don't know. I just feel like we shouldn't ignore how toxic these fucking trends are and how dumb they are tricking people and you know doing that can we hit this amount of likes just because like hey i'll do that because she's young and she needs likes and stuff like that just like dev like dev did this stuff and he got his channel terminated the channel's back now 
But I don't know, whatever. I'm not bullying her, right? Shut up. Oh my gosh, it's Granny! Hello! Oh my gosh, guys! Are you nice? Are you nice? Yes. Really? I don't believe a guy's coming down below. It's it going down below everything. I can't believe people believe this. Okay, so here's my dilemma these videos get extreme amount of views like 2.5 million views on a free pm one how many people who watch this believe it because as much as we want to believe no one believes it it people do like it can't be two point almost 2.6 million ironic viewings like you got 78,000 likes like how many people believe this stuff it's painful <laughs> okay I'm, I'm done with this i can't anymore but to be fair how many of these are real some of them must be right. Like I know I didn't watch any of them in the in the video, but the McDonald's ones must be real. Is that Inigo, is that Inigo, is that board? I No cheek it, check it, check it, check it, not cheek it. Look at this, this is the workers' blood. I have some bad news. What? Check it out. Wait, what? It's what? like no. Open the no. No, 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 no. You, it's <laughs> no, this isn't so good. Really do. That the that guy, guy ate all the like, food. It was like McFlurry, like spilled everywhere, dude. No, bro. Oh, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> like, what, what are they gonna do? Go into the McDonald's and put them in the, the Happy Meal? They must. They must be. Real. I mean, I'm not. I'm not just gonna assume that they aren't real, you know, you gotta give them a chance, they could be telling the truth, I could just be ignorant, you know, ghosts may exist. Why is this so far out of the question? Okay, I think, I think I've made my mind up, I think there's only one thing that I should do right now, and that is go and see if this is real or not. And there's only one way I can do that. Okay, so I'm now a 16 year old walking down the street holding a uh, McDonald's half meal. <laughs> Looks totally wrong. At least we can test it now. <sighs> okay, I have my test subject. This is also uh, totally the same day. Ignored the change of shirt. This is totally not. <clears throat> nine months later okay so i've got two boxes here i've got one which is a li little less scary than the other now you've got team titans and then ready for the monster side so i feel like this one i'll open second as it's more likely to be true also there's no food in there because i've already eaten it um, i thought i'd spare you the the mukbang open up this one first it's a bit it's a bit scary a little bit i mean you can see the adrenaline running through my veins I just know what this is. It's an Angry Birds. That could have cracked the wall. Okay, so that clearly was a dud. That was not what we were looking for. That's one. Oh, uh, there's multiple toys in here. Don't worry about why. Certainly not because I thought I lost one of the boxes and had to buy another one. All right, second bit. This is just a cup, okay? Just to break out a little bit. A cup. McDonald's, seriously. I remember when I was like a kid and they used to like give you like cars or like little soft like dog toys and stuff. Not dog toys, but toys of dogs. Cups tend to be a happy meal, not a drink. Second one, dud. No, thank you. This first box. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. You can see my hoodie in the corner, I'm sorry. I, I guessed that one was going to be, you know, nothing. I guessed that was going to be fine, mostly because of the box, and it was also mostly just because I'm a genius. But. But. It's not over yet. Second test subject.
nothing in it. Just a piece of paper. Wasn't even a fucking toy. God damn, I spoke to God. He said if you approach the God, the red dot him. I've seen more dead bodies than Logan Paul. Call me a YouTube rapper like I am proud, bitch. Wow, bitch, up with your reaction when I get wild, rich. Oh, I can throw these bloody things out. Over a year. 